Oh my god, that looks so good. We've decided we're going to live in like a class. I'm trying to learn how to vlog. We're at an airport right now. Oops. This trip was um, not in existence a month ago, and now we're about to go to Europe, so. And that's on crisis after college. Well, we were gonna go to New York. When an Airbnb for New York City costs like $300, you're kind of like, well, go big or go home. We're at Minneapolis airport right now. Our flight leaves at 10, 20 p.m. Somebody wanted to get here three hours early. So we have a while to go yet. Basically, we want to escape desperately. <laughs> That's what's happening. Yeah. We're going to Amsterdam <laughs> and then um, we're going to Brussels, Belgium. <laughs> because Ashley has a deep desire to be French. They, they speak French in Belgium. That's why you were so excited to go. And the waffles. And chocolate. Here. I care more about the chocolate than anything else, for sure. So I got my nails done for this, just <laughs> so I can be um, film worthy. I bit my nails off for this. <laughs> This is how we're different. People are gonna find this on YouTube and be like, what the? I hope they find this on YouTube, that's the whole point. So what I'm saying is smash that subscribe button. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> we were not planning on getting on a plane a month ago. <laughs> change the lighting hit romance <laughs> <laughs> our other lighting oh, options just our forest forest sunset Ooh. that's a bad i like that yeah. disco <laughs> read oh, who's reading in this yeah, who can read in this chaos? This is There's a lot of so stimulation. Is there on. a way to get it to stay still? Uh, we got here three minutes ago. Do okay. we want to talk about how we got here? It involves doing something illegal. <laughs> in our okay. defense. Okay. Eight hour plane ride. Fine. Except for Multiple... the crying baby <laughs> and the kid having a table. Yeah, the like lights are grade. changing currently. Yeah. They were orange, they are now red we get to the airport in amsterdam we'll just use the public transport because we had researched it got the app with the correct one hour pass to be able to use on all the buses and trams and trains we use the train to get from the airport to the first stop which is where we had to switch to a tram yeah and we got off the train and we literally can't leave <laughs> so i scanned the barcode on like the little on scanners it was like nope this pass doesn't work and both of us are like well what do we do now <laughs> We're and literally we, stuck in this metro. Then we kind of snuck out illegally behind other people. I see the doors open and I bolt and I'm like, hopefully Sarah's coming behind me. I didn't want the doors to shut on me either. We got through and then we were like, this is too much work. We called an Uber. I think his name was Wilhelm. I went to Wilhelm. But the lighting keeps changing. I don't know. I do not know, man. This is our humble abode. The ceiling is literally right here. You see that? That's the floor, the door, and that's literally, that's it. There's a whole space. There's this little window right here. But then it's then it's wall, wall, <laughs> yep. ceiling. That's, That's the vibe. Not that we're planning on spending a lot yeah. of time in here. I think it's kind of cool. Like it's a unique experience. The lighting situation is making me feel chaotic. Okay. <laughs> No one has ever had such drastically different aesthetics. Featuring the Beatles, featuring France. Off to explore. Coffee count number one of number one of unlimited.
Dutch fries have been purchased and they've been eaten. I don't have a hand. Hold on. <laughs> They're like perfect. Just the right amount of salt, crispy. Mm -hmm. Those are excellent and so warm. My hands are so cold. I'm cold. <laughs> Ashley brought a cat. I did not bring him. He was in the building and he followed me. <laughs> Hello? He won't leave. And he doesn't have a collar, so that means he's a stray. Hello. We walked kind of along the canals, tried to get a canal cruise, but they were booked today, so we're gonna go tomorrow. We walked to the Dam Square, like Amsterdam Square, which is supposed to take us like 25 minutes, and it took a lot longer because we stopped in many stores, walked around a little bit, a little bit. We walked many, many miles. I'm going to crash. I'm on like three hours of sleep, not even three hours probably, and I'm exhausted. Day one. Done. We have coffee count number two. Welcome to day two. We literally never know if we're supposed to walk on the middle part of the street or the sidewalk or it's which part place. because there's bikes everywhere. Yep. And either way, wherever we walk, we get run over by bikes. For example, here's a bike sign. Where does that mean? Who knows? Day two, we're on a covered canal cruise. We should talk about the Van Gogh Museum. We just got done with that. Also, his death is suspicious. Yep. Currently watching BuzzFeed Unsolved about how he may have actually died. Um, I don't murder. Think he, um, yeah. Not I, suicide. Pretty confident. Mm -hmm. We've solved it. Let me rephrase. Gelato, which is way better. And we also had those delicious pasta. Yes, we had really good pasta. We realized that she actually did have a coffee on the plane. So this is coffee count number four. Day three, coffee four. Today, I actually ordered food that I like. We have bread, I have eggs coming, and I have milk. <laughs> I'm very excited about it. These are literally rotting bones and skulls. <laughs> literally a bone pit. They would dig up old graves when they needed another spot for someone, mm -hmm. and they just dumped the bones here. But only for the people who paid for the graves. The glass has condensation on it because the bones are rotting. Currently in the Older Kirk, which is like the oldest church. I feel there's a building in the city. It's the oldest building in the city in Amsterdam. Oh, we should show the map. This is a map of all the graves and all their numbers, where they are in the church. They were they're... buried in 1792, and then if you look at the map, and this is section M, so you go to section M, and you're looking for 78, was it? And so we go to 78, and then we could go find them, <laughs> theoretically. What was the oldest one found? 15 something, there was one that was 15 14. something. Oh yeah. But it says NA next to it, and I'm not sure what that means. The oldest that we found was like a buried or death date was 15. 40 ish 15, 40 ish yeah. And then all, all the bones of the one older than that are just oh lying in a pit under the gravestone floor. Yep. So we're 
currently at the Wog. Bug? I don't know how to say it. I Aren't know. W's V's? That's a great question. I am technically Dutch, but I don't know the answer to that. This used to be like the oldest non-religious building in the city, and it used to be part of the city walls. It was the city gate, so it's really old, but now it's a cafe. Right. Is it really a video if the camera doesn't fall over at some point? Good. To get here, we had to walk through the red light district. Keep in mind that it is noon on a Monday. Um, I'd say we've seen things now. Yeah, we've seen things. I expected to see it, but I didn't expect it to just like pop out of nowhere. You walk 10 feet and suddenly there's a window and there's a girl standing in the window with a ton of lingerie and you're kind of like, all right, oh, I know where I am. It's noon. That's the part that I think is shocking. Like you expect it to come out at night, but it's during the day. It's noon. Here we are. I don't know what that means, but number five. day three, um, number five. Also, why do they all come with crackers? I don't know, but I'm liking it. Also, there are cute boys here. Yes. Hopefully they don't speak like English because then we're out. 20 year olds-ish. And there's all these European men. Question. Are they going to come back over here? Yep. They're circling. Thank you. Oh my god, that looks so good. This is our second strip waffle that we got from the one that we were recommended to go to. It's warm and gooey and covered in chocolate. And, and this is all gone. that's left and it's about to be gone. <laughs> and then we'll pick apart all the crust pieces that can't come off because the caramel is stuck. So good. Go get a strip waffle. Guess who bought? Dutch cheese, a hefty, what is this, round of it? We went to a whole cheese store and tried a lot of cheeses. We were treated well. We were treated very Our well. Friend. He basically so good. gave us extra samples and he was like, I have so much cheese, try it all. to Brussels. <laughs> we took a train to Belgium, Brussels mm -hmm. this morning, and now we're here. And our room was available three hours early. It's hot. We're on so. the sixth floor. It's like 67 degrees outside, yep. which is warmer than I felt in many months. Also, we hopped off the train a stop early to be closer, and it worked. So we are officially travel experts. I've yes. never had it go so well in my entire life. <laughs> off to explore Brussels. Belgian waffles have been acquired. <laughs> Sucker for European cathedrals and churches. Wow. Just a royal palace, casually. Hi, royal family. Hi. Alright, coffee count what? Um, six? 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 Mm -hmm. Featuring hot But now we're in Brussels. First coffee in Brussels and it's not half bad. What a compliment. <laughs> you literally cannot see the whole thing. It's so big. describe how absolutely massive this is. I had to sit down to take a picture. But I got a good one. I, my phone literally has to be flat to capture all of it. Some weird guy just looked at us and smirked. I could care less, <laughs> honestly. Yes, I'm a tourist, no, I don't care. I think that's been the like theme of this whole thing. Oh, that's for sure the motto. This I have so many questions. <laughs> Decided we're going to live in Le Grand Place, which is this lovely space. Big 
big square. We're not gonna live in a building. We're gonna just lie on the cobblestone. Yeah, just stay here. Because this square does something. It does something. Be, I don't know what. <laughs> I don't know what it is. We've been here. How many times today have we been here? At least to this five. Square. We five went today? when we first got here, and we were both like. <gasps> And we walked around and then we somehow ended up back here and then it's we like went somewhere else and then came back here and then went somewhere else and came back here so that might be six i don't know it, i lost track it's many times someone else do the math i think it's the ambiance <laughs> the vibes are immaculate i think if it's not the golden buildings with the gothic architecture it just feels cozy and safe and nice also the warm weather too long to read we want to live on the cobblestone in the grand place Full day. Hey. Don't let me down. Don't let me down. I'm a weary, lonely man, man doing what I can. Yesterday it was technically seven, not six. So this is eight. How do we determine that yesterday was seven? Because I watched the videos back. We'll go back and double check. But well, yeah, yeah. Said seven. Either way, it's a high number. We just went to the Marguerite Museum, which, if you're not aware, if you've watched The Fault in Our Stars, this is not a pipe. That's that guy. He did that. Yeah. We were on search for the waffle that you had yesterday, so I could get one. But then we stopped because we got sandwiches. This is literally cheese and butter. We love being picky. That's not picky. That's just a quality sandwich. What are you talking about? Okay, it's true. I think it still tastes great. It's so. quality sandwich. And then we also have pan de chocolate. You're welcome. I said the egg mm -hmm. thing instead of saying it's a chocolate croissant, which is apparently wrong. Even though to me, it's a chocolate croissant. And it's not chocolatine for anyone French watching. It's pan de chocolate. <laughs> okay. We get back. Just realizing there's literally a NATO meeting tomorrow in Brussels. And we also may have seen Justin Trudeau as my guest. There's a whole big band of fancy looking cars. Surrounded by like police cars with yeah. the Canadian flag. And one of them, yeah. There's police all over the place. Something is definitely happening. Oh, there's a lot of people in suits as well. This is interesting. Waffles have been acquired. I have chocolate on mine. I have Nutella, as per usual. This is the third waffle yep. we've had. This is my third. This is my first. Waffles are so much better with chocolate on them. And we're back in La Grand Place again. We don't even need directions to get here anymore. When you become obsessed with a place so much that you buy paintings of them. <laughs> That it was in fact Justin Trudeau and his whole line of vehicles that we saw because he apparently arrived this morning. There was a lot of security and then there was a car with some Canadian flags. Crazy. <laughs> Your girls tested negative. <laughs> yep. Why is your phone broken? I wasn't recording. Oh, we were supposed to go there, but. Oh, from the US? Yeah. yeah. Where from? Minnesota. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, it's not that. I still don't have a coat on. <laughs> um, 